I think that for me, the most common thing that's really um, frequently, over and over again, repeatedly just met incredible success is whenever I uh, go to the effort of not just saying, okay, as a teacher of mathematics, um, one of the common misconceptions is that math is all about, or well, there's a bunch of processes, there's formulas and algorithms. And you just have to memorize the steps. And then when you meet a question, you just pick out the right numbers and you do them in the right order. And then out pops an answer magically. And um, getting that answer and doing that accurately and quickly, uh, many people think that that's what mathematics is about. But one of the things that excites me most is whenever mathematics can, um, when we can understand the story behind, number one, why the mathematics was developed, like why were people interested in solving this kind of problem, and the path, which is often not at all a straight line, A to B kind of, yeah, we worked out the answer really, really directly, but there's often a winding sort of narrative to how people devised um, the methods and techniques that we use and rely on every day. So I really love, over and over again, when I talk about geometry or when I talk about complex numbers or talk about any kind of branch of mathematics where often things were people were very confused you know people think of mathematics as this set in stone everyone knew this from time immemorial but actually it's this messy process that has a really intriguing story behind it so every time I've been able to um, dig into that story and, and share it with my students there's always been a lot of connection with them they understand why there's a context and a reason for learning what they're learning